Hello YouTube. Hi YouTube. Hey, what's up you guys? It's your boy back again and today, uh, me and the missus, we are off to Brighton uh, for a weekend away. Um, first time going away together, it's a bit scary, isn't it? Mm, I'm excited though. Yeah, I am very excited. Um, we literally have like two minutes before we've got to leave, so I just thought I'd pop on and say hi. Uh, if you do like this video, in the end, it's going to be the whole weekend, so just do drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you uh, on the coach. Um. We have made it to the coach. Um, we're currently stuck at Victoria Coach Station, um, and we depart um, we at 12, I think like five minutes. minutes. Oh, eight minutes. Eight minutes. Okay, eight minutes to departure. Um, I will put some travel montage stuff in the video because we'll be driving through London and we all know I love London. Do you love London? Yeah, it's alright. <laughs> and on that note, <laughs> see you in Brighton. Alive, I think, kind yeah. of. Are we alive? Yeah. Good. Uh, the Brighton Pier is behind us. We are going there in a minute. We've just got to go and find a hotel and check in. Uh, I'll give you guys a room tour and then we're going to head over to the uh, Palace Pier, which is just over there behind me. Very, very excited for that. Um, so you're in the uh, hotel room, I guess. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go! We made it to the room. Uh, let's have a little spin around the room tour. So you can see uh, Georgia is settling in to the room in here. You come in and you've got the lovely bathroom with our tiny human shower. Very cute. Um, also the toilet, the sink and me. Hello. Um, then you come out and we've got another lovely mirror just so I can look at myself again. Hello. Uh, we have our bedside table with the phone, our lovely bed television, wardrobe, our side table, so we have our um, kettle tea coffee facilities, and then our beautiful sea view. Look how gorgeous it is. Um, and we're going to be heading out there in just a moment. We uh, are by the sea. Georgia is over there because she's too scared to uh, come down as close as I am to the water. Um, uh, why do you like to be beside the seaside? Um, that's probably going to get copyright strike. But yeah, it's the sea. Look. Look. Ah! Woohoo! Run away! <laughs> go home drunk, your house. I mean, go home house, you're drunk. We did make it to the end of the pier, however, she almost got shat on. So, we decided to come inside to one of the arcades. Probably going to play some games, um, got a milkshake or something. Yes, please. And I need to find a new SD card. Now! We got the milkshakes. We did the pier, uh, we did some arcade playing, we won some tickets, uh, and we've got milkshakes. Mm. I went for banoffee pie. Cookies and cream! Yeah, I like these already. I've just had cream. Nice. <laughs> yeah. We acquired the SD card. This is literally on its last legs. Um, and now we're wandering down the high street. Probably going to find some place to eat dinner soon. You got my bank. Well. <laughs> I'm keeping it in. We found a cute little American diner. Um, it's really cool. Uh, I'm gonna like try and get some videos of like some of the stuff on the wall. Like it's really, really, really cool stuff. That you can see. Um, They're all dreams. That you've got loads of stuff. A girlfriend. <laughs> it's Audrey Hepburn. Uh, but yeah, really, really cool in here. Are you enjoying your scenario? Yeah. Good. Food has arrived. I mean, that onion ring is big enough to move out and get its own mortgage. <laughs> I'm well excited for that. Like, look at it. Lots of food there. I want to see if it's the same size as my face. Go on. 
the next day. Day two in Brighton. Uh, we are ready for the day. We've got a busy day planned. We've got uh, the British Airways I360, mm. which is just outside of our hotel room that way. Um, then we have the Brighton Sea Life Centre. So we all know from, we like a sea life. Yeah, the vlog last week. Um, that, yeah, we like a sea life centre. Um, and then we're going to go to the marinas, mm -hmm. um, which is why there's some bright pink lipstick. Um, there is a reason for it, and you will find out. Um, we're going to get some cool shots on the i360s like that, and the sea life centre should be fun. And so should with the marinas. We've got a busy day. Um, there's uh, jellyfish in this sea life centre. I need to see them. She's excited about jellyfish. Yeah. On that note, let's go. Girlfriend. She has never seen jellyfish before. Clearly, look at them. Blah 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 so like the child I am, I've climbed into the little cave thing. And look. I don't know how well this is gonna be. Yeah, that's just not very good. But look, it's just I'm in the dome thing, it's tiny in here. But I thought I would get a good cool shot. <laughs> so uh please just like the video for my claustrophobia, please. I'm claustrophobic, Darren! It's piranhas, bub. Remember this from the last video? I've been reunited with my shinies. <laughs> We are about to do the best bit of any sea life centre. Uh, the walk through tunnel that's just got our heads. And this one has turtles and sharks as well. Let's turn it around and see what we can see. Look at the size of them. Hello. These are 
person. He is. I think so, yeah. He ain't camera show. Oh! Oh, they had a crash! They had a crash. Don't have a crash. It's fine. It's fine. It looks Look like them. me after a night out falling down. What? They've crashed. They have crashed. It's a walkthrough, but dedicated entirely to Nemo and Dory. I mean, look at the Eminem and Eminem and Eminem and Eminem and Eminem and the Dory? There's Dory. Uh, I mean, I say it's a walkthrough. I am literally on my knees. Slouch. Uh huh. <laughs> it's Oliver the Octopus. Is he there, Mom? Probably not, but. Um, well. He's quite cool. He's quite cool. It's my octopus teacher. That was Brighton Sea Life Centre. Um, we're two hours ahead of our schedule that we had planned, so we're probably going to stop for some hot donuts and maybe go back onto the pier for a little bit. Um, and then we're heading down to the Brighton Arena. I'm is, excited for that. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be great fun. We saw it when we was on the i360. Uh, there's a lot of birds um, about. I, I cannot hate birds. see at all. A few moments later. And we have made it. As you can see for the sign behind, we are at the Brighton Marina. After a long walk. Two and a half miles of walking or just over. We are exhausted. We're definitely going to get in there. Uh, I've caught your scarf. Um, we're going to get in there, find somewhere to sit down and have a bite to eat. Probably in with them. Um, and then we're going to see what activities and shops are here on the marina. We have been fed and watered at uh, the Golden Arches. Very nice pub. Um, <laughs> And now we're going into Hollywood Bowl to play some bowling uh, in like an American style. I'm going to feel like I'm in Greece too. If anyone's seen Greece too, I like you. So in hindsight, we should have pre-booked. The next lane isn't available until 9 p.m. Uh, and we just we just can't do that. So we should have pre-booked. Therefore, really, but hey ho, don't want that one. So we are at Global's. Um, we're going to play the carnival games because they're unfortunately fully booked for the golf. Um, so we're going to get the carnival games a go. Really excited for it. It looks really cool. It's really well themed in here. Feel the buzz, feel the buzz, baby, feel the buzz. Did you learn? I like it. <laughs> Trolley number two. Oh, you do that one. <laughs> two trolleys, two trolleys. And to remind you, that is 500 points. 500 points so far. Oh, really? That's Coming in, last one. The next time we've got to let down, we've got a limbo. Uh, and I think the first one's going to be rather easy for you. Come on, off you go. <laughs> you cheat. Cheetah, cheetah, pumpkin eater. Meet me at the culture. This is a hoopla Hi. game. There's lots of, uh, is that a carousel? This is so cool. And that must be our next game after this. One so far. I don't care. Well, you missed. You missed again. Come on. Go. So that looks like two blues, which is 100 points. So this is how you play this game. Uh, I've just got three on the 200 and two on the 150. Uh, so I think that means it is uh, 900 points. Yeah, I'll have 900 points, please. The incredible flying bleaks. You choose your seat, you sit in it, reach the hands in front, and then when you go, go, you pedal as fast as you can, and the first person to get it all the way up wins. So it's time for Carnival Queen, and here she is. Uh, reminds me of somebody I know, I'm not going to say who. <laughs> um, 
Um, but I think it is uh, hitting the bell. How are we going to do, Bob? Oh, dear God. <laughs> Lincoln Bio. So we just did Fortune Flurry and it was like the Crystal Maze thing at the end. You press this button, right, and all hell breaks loose. <laughs> so another game done, we just did Welcome to the Freak Show, uh, which is like a catapult into some holes. Um, Georgia won! Georgia won! She got three in! I only got two! It's funny what you see at the fair. This is a hook a duck game on the ship happens with uh, the pluck a duck tent. So, if you get knocked off, you lose a thousand points. Georgia won't go up there because the child in front just banged her head. So, uh, I'm going to guess <laughs> I'm going to have to take the drop twice. So, fun! For the last ride, we go pick out our carriage, put the balloon on the uh, corresponding nipple, and make sure you pump it on or it'll fly off. Head back to the carriage, I'll just play a cast of three, and you'll start pumping. Uh, if Rob allowed, first place gets 1,000 points, second place 800 points. Who's going to win, Bob? Not me. I just want to add, I love the theming of this. It's a ghost train, it's great. We exited Globals. And I won. <laughs> How do you feel? Yes, yeah, alright, I'm a sore bit. It's fine because it wasn't necessarily golf and she probably would have beat me at golf, isn't that right? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> you wouldn't have beat me at that either. <laughs> Look how cool that is. Look how cool the water looks. See, that one is moving. Wait. Weather spoons. I said that's a posh weather spoon. Let's go. Getting in the gas, getting in the hat. I have a chair, I have a chair. Oh yes, very nice. We decided to go for a Nando's for dinner tonight. Uh, the missus is happy. She's got uh, spicy mixed olives. Um, I went for the halloumi to start and then we've got a full platter to share. Um, I've not had Nando's for years. So I'm really, really looking forward to having some Nando's. Um, yeah, I mean, I'll catch up with the food here. So the food has just arrived. We've got the full platter. Are you ready? Uh, Are you sure? Yeah. Ah. Oh, we started. Look at that. It's spilling it everywhere. It's hot. <laughs> Let's tuck in. Um, I don't know what the next up there will be. Let's find out. The next day. Day three. Um, final full day in Brightonian land. We have a busy day planned, we've got the uh, Royal Pavilion today, the lanes, which is really, really popular. It's like a bunch of really cool, quirky shops. shopping. Yeah, shopping. Uh, and we're going to try and squeeze in mini golf because we didn't get the chance at Globals. But yeah. we have to see because the weather is a bit... Uh, yeah, the waves are like the height of me, so... And maybe as you can see, she's two foot tall. So, it's probably not the best thing to do today. No, but we'll give it a go, we'll see, we'll see what we get out of there. Yeah. But let's head out there and see what uh, Brighton has to offer for our final full day. Remember the house that was drunk and I told it to go home? We're in it. Um, this is really trippy. Uh, <laughs> there's a monkey and there's an upside down Lionel Richie as well. Oh my god, that's amazing. Um, so check out the photos that are now on my Instagram uh, from this house. Um, there's a drum kit. <laughs> It's mental, this is crazy. Um, I'll try and vlog a couple more in here, but if not, check out the photos on my Instagram, link in the description. And now we're upstairs, there's a whole bed. Um, this is gonna look really cool, look. She can't help but not fall over. <laughs> They've got an actual jukebox. It's re it is actually really wonky and quite like, it's a bit, a bit steady on your feet. But um, yeah, don't forget pictures on the Instagram. You can see behind me the Royal Pavilion, the Brighton Royal Pavilion. However, online it doesn't say anything about admission charge. Uh, I think we're fully booked out in terms of booking stuff. Yeah. So we can't actually go in and see it, but it is really cool. You see it behind me, it was um, gifted to Brighton 
uh, by Queen Victoria. Fun fact for you. I take me every day. There you go. And behind me here, you've got the Brighton Museum and Art Gallery. So we're going to go and see if that is a free admission. If it is, we'll have a look in there. Um, and yeah, let's see. So we've gone for the uh, Museum and Art Gallery. So far, we've seen the chair exhibit, uh, which is quite cool actually. They've got some really uh, unique chairs. There are some over here as well. Um, are you enjoying yourself so far? Yeah. Good. I think my camera's about to die, so I need the spare battery, please. These are actual mummified tails of cats. Like, what? What? You can't really wear them, can you? Right. But it is quite cool. They're, they're from, um, they're made of wood, and they're from like 4,000 years ago. It's quite cool that they still exist. Old programs for the Palace Pier, which we were at a couple of days ago with the uh, Admission tickets there as well, and lots of different posters of different shows that was on there. Uh, really, really cool. Uh, somebody who likes theatre to see this stuff. The world famous aquarium and creepy punch of Judy Star, which uh, you can tell she loves. Look, she's running away. What have you found? What is it? It's Andrew and George. Cool. If somebody with this many windows ever had a crash, I swear to God. So what this actually is, is a comparison between a Neanderthal, so what they used to look like, uh, and how we have developed to look now. And this is ultra realistic. Like, he could actually turn around and look at me right now, and I would jump. We're in the performance area. And this is going to be where we're in our element. Absolutely, is it? Lots of puppets. This looks like the, you know, in Charlie in the Chocolate Factory when he eats the thing in its hair. He just turns into a hairy. Do you know what I mean? And there is Mr. Bumble out of Oliver. Dance, monkey, dance. <laughs> so now we're into the LGBT history. Um, there's lots of LGBT history. Uh, Julian Clary's up there. This is going to be quite a cool little exhibition. So here shows all the different badges, fighting aids here, Jurex, Brighton Sports LGBT, Russia, and an LGBT prison shown there, and a trans rights with a beautiful picture of King Freddy. So, RuPaul's Drag Race Joe Black's purple, beautiful outfit is in here, along with some other really popular drag artists, costumes, wigs, uh, accessories, shoes, um, some of these people you may have heard of. And yeah, wow, wee. Hours and hours of work when it's this beautiful piece of art. So I've switched over to the phone because it is raining, I don't want to risk the camera getting wet. I don't know if there's any uh, quality changes, but tomorrow before we go home, we've got something really exciting. Um, Georgia is getting her very own lipstick uh, made and stuff. So, and we're back, we're going to that restaurant later tonight, just down there, Dobatello on the corner. Um, yeah, you're getting uh, your own lipstick tomorrow, just, just before we go home as well. We just bought donuts as well. And they're, they're healthier than uh, a buttered toast slice. So, and they're beautiful. Very nice indeed. Let's go see what the lanes has to offer. So the lanes uh, so far have proven to be full of jewellers. Yep. Um, they've also been proved to be very uh, tight and winding. I'm not sure how we're going to get out. But I'm not complaining. It's actually really quite cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's the weather's a bit poor. That's why I had to switch to my phone. It's a bit drizzly and stuff. We don't really know it's raining, but they're really cool. Also, can I just add um, something? The donuts were consumed. The donuts were consumed, but they were very good. So if you ever find yourself in Brighton, urban donuts. We keep getting lost. It's so windy and weird. We should come out of the duck house. It is literally, you can see inside. It is just a bunch of fun donuts. It's so cool. It's so cool. Um, but yeah, we keep getting lost. It's so windy and crazy. And... <laughs> so get an Italian girlfriend, they said. Be fun, they said. She's eating a, what is it? Well done, I'm proud of you. With a vanilla um, 
Pino Latte. Yeah. This is definitely just a squash YouTube dunk, exactly. <laughs> um, I'm going to try the Canadian one. Let's give it a go. Go, please. Do you like it? Mmm. Yeah. That's actually time, really nice. Next time you can do it properly. It started absolutely chucking it down, didn't it? I got scared. Yeah. So we've come into a Primark because there's definitely no Primarks in Rockford <laughs> um, to get out of the weather, and I also need to get some bits. Um, oh, sorry. <laughs> I mean, brilliant. So yeah, we're gonna uh, we're still on the phone because the camera's in the bag, and I'll be. Oh, kids section. I can look in here. I can't be asked to get it back out. Um, let's find what they've got. Oh, we're back in the warm. That I'm weather. traumatized. The I'm weather. actually traumatized. Like the wind, five million miles an hour winds, peeing down with rain. I mean, look, I'm soaked. We are. And I'm just mentally done by that. I've never been so scared of my life. We've got our little plug-in heater that the uh, hotel brought up for us because it was a bit cold in the room so we've got that on the go to try and sort of warm up the room a bit Ooh. definitely have to put my trainers on the radiator to dry up um, let's answer mum say hi to the vlog okay uh -huh. <laughs> I'm, keep, I'm, I'm keeping that in <laughs> Valentine's meal time uh, we are ready Raring to go, we're going to Uber it because I don't know if you can hear, but the wind is still as powerful as it was earlier when we ran away from it. Um, so we're going to Uber it there, but I'm uh, really looking forward to it, aren't you? Yes. I am as well. <laughs> Let's go. The next day. It has come to the time where it is time to check out of the hotel. Very sad, it's been very, very fun. We've got a couple more last things to be doing for the video today. Uh, and before we go back, our coach leaves at like half three. Yeah. Uh, and the time now is like half ten, so we've got a few hours to kill, got a little bit more activities to do, so let's go and do that, um, and we'll see you there. <laughs> Look, she's very excited to get her very own lipstick here at the Lip Lab in Brighton. Very cold. Opening specifically for this one today. Do you feel lucky? Yeah, I do. Good. I'm going to see if we're allowed to sort of vlog some of it. Um, if not, I'll show you the finished product. Awesome. We have just finished in the lip pad. Here it is. Um, you named it what? 2000. She's got it on now. I'm not sure if you can see it. Mm. It's very, very nice, um, like sort of muted purple. Um, and she's so lovely. Like she opened specifically for us today. Yeah. And Chelsea is amazing. Yeah. So uh, we'll definitely be coming back next time we're in Brighton. Yeah. Uh, but for now, I think we should have a stroll along the seafront. Yeah. Uh, before we have to get Go going. Pick our luggage back up. Get on a coach. Yeah. Let's see what else is about. We're going home. I don't want to go home. Sorry, Mum. Goodbye, Brighton. We're on our way home. And we are back in uh, sunny Romford. Um We've chosen to go into a weather to grab some dinner uh, before we head home. Um, it was a long trip. It was, yeah. So we are just very hungry and would like So I've got food. gin. I've got beer. Huh? Yeah. Like uh? I've got water. Food has arrived, so we're going to eat uh, and then we're going to head home and that will probably be the end. Yeah. And there you have it, home. Mm -hmm. That has been the Brighton vlog, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to like and subscribe down below. We're very tired aren't we? Yeah. I think it's bedtime, not bed. Oh, bedtime, bedtime. Um, and my socials are on the screen, don't forget to check them all out and don't forget the upside downy housey pictures are on my Instagram now so the link is in the description below. I will see you in my next video, hopefully you've enjoyed this one. Sorry it's been a long one but yeah, see you soon, bye!